So today there are cryptocurrencies and there are fiat currencies. You understand fiat currencies are currencies that a legal government or a legal government has um, approved to be legal. For instance, you have US dollars, you have European euro, you have um, Japanese yen, you have Canadian dollars. So all these things have been approved legal by governments around, around the world. And then there are cryptocurrencies like the Bitcoin, the Ethereum, the Ripples, and all these currencies you're seeing here, Litecoin, Dash, and so on and so forth, they are cryptocurrencies. Now, in our own spreadsheet, we have, according to our calculations, we have um, current source currencies. All these things are called um, origin currencies. That's what we will call them so that we can use them. So these are all origin currencies. There are close to 1,000 of them. And then there are destination uh, fiat currencies, which are the ones that the uh, real world um, government have appro has approved. So we're going to try and find out, um, retrieve automatically the conversion, how much uh, uh, an origin currency is worth in a fiat currency. So we can, for instance, say how much Bitcoin, it, one Bitcoin is worth in US dollars or Canadian dollars, or depending on the fiat currency you want to convert it to. So there are, 18 uh there are 15 fiat currencies 16 fiat currencies that we we'll work with 16 and the 16 of them oh don't mind all this uh why am i making mistakes here all right 16 so the 16s are all these australian australian dollars and also on and so for canadian dollars and the us dollars as you can see there's usd there's um euro japanese yen and um Korean one you understand so these guys are 16 and then we have ethereum and Bitcoin bitcoins are cryptocurrencies but we'll add them to the number of destination currencies so people can use them find uh, the value of whatever coin they have in Bitcoin so the the short code for Bitcoin is BTC and for ethereum it is ETH so we'll add the two of them so these are the total destination currencies we have and then the rest of these guys are um, origin currencies. So the rest of these guys are origin currencies. If you want to find what their code is, just click on it. So if I click on Ripple, I'm looking for its three letter code. Its three letter code is XRP. You understand? Just like Bitcoin is BTC. So let us find the value of a currency in uh, and convert it to a fiat currency. For instance, let's find the current value of Bitcoin. So let us find the current value of um, Bitcoin in USD. So we'll do an equal sign. Make sure there is no space in your equal sign before your equal sign. Your equal sign must be the first um, character there. So we'll do equal sign. Then we'll do crypto finance. Select it. And then we enter inside quotes. I will say the code for the coin the source coin which is bitcoin i'm looking for its value in usd so this is the destination fiat currency this is the origin coin so when i've typed it like this and hit enter it will say, say loading and it will tell me what it is in dollars so what i want to do is to create a column insert column by the left so i have a, a small column by the left and i just want to play a little plank prank so it will be cool for my eyes to see so i will just type in dollar sign and um, i'll make my i'll highlight this column highlight this column come here and make sure that everything typed there is moved to the right as you can see the dollar moves to the right i'll do the same thing for this column highlight everything and make sure that it moves to the left so it looks like this so i have bitcoin at 5518 uh, dollars right now so let's do the same thing for ethereum so ethereum in dollars remember you can check it even in canadian dollars so let's say if you want to check it for canadian dollars i will just do an equal sign i'll type crypto finance open and close quotes then close the bracket then i come back and type the code for ethereum which is eth i'll put slash then canadian dollar cad hit enter so in Canadian dollars, Bitcoin is worth 400, uh, Ethereum is worth $410. But if I change it to US dollars, I will see 
that it is worth um, 329 so see generally it depends on how you want to organize your sheet my main aim is to just show you what is available you can now use your own ingenuity and organize your sheet according to the currencies you need to track for me in this course i just need to track us dollars so i want to know that uh, the, the price of bitcoin for today is five thousand one hundred and eighteen dollars and then uh, the price of ethereum is uh, this amount so i can just do that for ripple too assuming i invested in multiple currencies more than this so i can just say i want to know the price in dollars i will do um, equal sign by now you should know this crypto finance i'll do this i can uh, just say xrp that's the code for ripple in usd and then i'll hit enter so it is in 0 0.2 dollars you understand so this kind of makes sense to us so in the next video we'll see how we can do other manipulations but so far if i just open my uh, browser any day uh, or in my phone i will just see that you bitcoin is in is already five thousand us dollars so thank you very much in the next video